Hey, and welcome back to the next episode of my Hardcore Iron Man. Last episode, I got on it with the quests and really thinned the list down a lot. So that is looking awesome right now. Uh, not many more to complete, so hopefully I'm going to do them soonish. Um, also, we finally managed to get into the upper tier of the Farmer Guild, which is something I've been working towards for absolutely ages now. So finally getting in there was a massive, awesome feeling, if you get me. Yeah. Anyway, let's get on with the next clip. And hopefully with this next successful thief, there we go, another skill into the 90s. It's been so long. Um, I just felt like doing a bit of thieving at the minute. And uh, yeah, 90 thieving coming in. Um, I'd really like to get 99 thieving, but the thing is, it's just going to take absolutely ages. So uh, I don't know when I'm going to do it, but I'm going to carry on for a bit now. Finally, this should be 91 thieving coming in. Uh, I can now enter the 8th and final room of the Tomes and Sephanum. Cool. Uh, I, I do want to go there at some point, but uh, I think I'm going to get 99 first, I think. Uh, it's going to earn me a decent amount of money, but that's if I can find a decent world with a good splasher in it anyway. So, yeah, and we've uh, pickpocketed over a million coins now, so that's my biggest stack going. So it's pretty damn good. So I was doing a quick farm run before I go to work this morning and came across a dragon impling. Ah, oh, yes, finally. I uh, got some dragon bones, so that's going to be some more prior XP. I've run out of dragon bones too, so that's excellent. So this is my first ever spirit tree that I grew. I meant to grow one earlier, but I kind of forgot. 20k XP coming in, that's crazy. Also, I just got another Hispori seed. The Hispori seeds are building up super quick. Uh, a bit of Seltrus tree as well, and I'm gonna grow a curry seed tree thing soon. I said that completely wrong. Yeah, coming in with a new PB at Hisporia 117. I can't remember what it was originally now, but um, yeah, it's getting better. And that's Malie only, and I also just got a dragon fruit seed. Ah, oh, what a beautiful, beautiful day. Oh man, I'm coming in a little bit late with this, but the account has now reached 60 million total XP, which is quite impressive for me personally, because uh, I, I thought the account would have died a very long time ago, so we're doing alright so far. So far, so good. Coming in with 89 strength. Ah. Uh, I was AFK and at work and I nearly got the level, but luckily I didn't get it. Also, I got a Dragon Impling and got two Dragonstone Amulets. Beautiful. Uh, I've also got a lamp, but I'm going to stick that in Runecraft in, but it's not going to get me a level, so I'm going to go back to some Slayer now. This was my fourth attempt at doing a hard clue scroll. Every single time I kept getting wilderness steps, it was really frustrating, so hopefully the rewards are a little bit better this time. Oh my days, they are definitely better. That is definitely and unique. Uh, I'm I'm pretty damn happy with that. I'm not I'm not going to complain. I am very pleased with that. And also I've got some more lore runes, which I definitely need. Ah, that was a good one. I'm going to start recording now because it's going to drop the next hit. There we are. 87 range coming in. Oh, I love getting range levels. Uh, and it's nowhere near strength for a change, which I still find a little bit odd. Uh, they used to be neck and neck for ages, but uh, strength started going ahead, and hopefully it's going to keep going ahead. Oh my god, I can't believe my luck. I think it was only a kill or two ago that I got a bottomless bucket, and now I've got another one. So um, I'm going to go check the bank and see how much all these are worth now. So now that puts our count up to three bottomless buckets, and they are worth two point nearly seven mil. So uh, yeah, that's kind of crazy. Nice to have on um, the account, kind of. Still doing the daily ecto functus runs. Uh, we're getting quite close to prayer now, but we had to collect our thousand tokens again, and. I don't think I'm ever going to use up all the usages on like the bones that I can convert with the bone crusher, so um, yeah, it's, it's a, that's a little bit mad, I thought. 207,000 charges. 
Oh man, I need to take this with me everywhere. Okay, so I'm gonna start recording now, else I will definitely miss it. There we go, 88 hit points. Ah, oh, that's a nice feeling. I love getting every hit point level, because uh, it just makes it a little bit harder to die, hopefully. Coming in with this next Steve, 92 Steven. We are officially halfway through Steven. Oh man, this is going to take so long to do. Uh, I, I don't mind doing Steven, but uh, yeah, it's just the time it takes. Doing a farm run, came across a ninja, anything good? Nah. So with the new update, you can now store all the saplings in the seed vault. So I uh, just spent a bit of time, made as many as I could. I've ran out of pots, so I'm going to go get some more at some point. Um, but if I know what I'm doing, uh, I thought I'd just check just to see what the price is of them all. And holy crap, that is a lot of money. Uh, and we've got a four spirit saplings as well. Um, yeah, I, I didn't think it was going to be worth that much. That is absolutely crazy. And with this last kill, that's 250 tasks completed all in one go. And not only that, we bury this bone, and there we go, 73 prayer coming in. Ah, oh, that's beautiful. Uh, I have enough points for the room pouch, but uh, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to get it yet, because I kind of want to keep some points saved up. Okay, I thought long and hard about this, and yeah, we're, we're buying it. If we need to block a task or whatever, then, you know, we've still got a few points left, so it's not too bad. But uh, with the room pouch, I said I was going to go do room crafting as soon as I got the room pouch, but uh, I kind of want to do some more Slayer at the minute, and also some Thieving, so that's going to be put on the back burner for a bit. So at the minute I've been doing a little bit of pest control but I just came out to do the end clip for the video. So yeah, I'm ending off the episode here. Next episode I really want to carry on with some more Slayer and a little bit of Thieving as well. Uh, there's a few other little things I want to do but I'm just super happy I've now got the room pouch. So it's, uh, it's going to make Slayer tests a little bit more interesting hopefully. So yeah, hopefully you enjoyed and I will see you next time. Thanks for watching.